Hello, it's Storytime Saturday here with Miss Melanie, and I'm so happy to see you, but I'm guessing you're really happy as well because you have now started holiday break, and you don't have to go back to school or back to the books until 2021. So, and another thing to be excited about, I bet, is you're less than a week away from Christmas. So, with that being said, I have chosen today, Five More Sleeps Till Christmas by Jimmy Fallon. Now, this is a book we had just recently got in here in December. So, since uh, we're reading a new book, I was going to share some of the other new books that we have gotten here in the last few months added to our children's library. But we're going to start with this book first, and then we'll... And then we'll go over some behind me. So, Five More Sleeps Till Christmas by Jimmy Fallon. All right, we're just starting with December 20th, which is tomorrow. Just five more sleeps till Christmas. Can you believe it? It's here. I know that Santa's coming soon because I've been good all year. Five more sleeps till Christmas. I'm not sure I can wait. I got good grades, I fed the dog, I even cleaned my plate. Gary's chew toy puppy is helping me count sheep, but it's not working. We're still up. We cannot, cannot fall asleep. Wide awake. Hmm, let's see about that. Oh no. So they decided to snooze. Four, December 21st now. Just four more sleeps till Christmas and a visit from Kris Kringle. The halls are decked, the trees trim, the bells are being jingled. The cocoa Coco's hot inside the mugs. The candy canes are crunched. The popcorn tin is empty because the popcorn's all been munched. Just four more sleeps then it's, and then it's here. I have to go to bed, but visions of my favorite toys keep dancing in my head. Uh-oh, but he fell fast asleep. Three now, December 22nd. Now it's three more sleeps till Christmas, and I'm looking at the snow. I'm watching every snowflake, thinking three more sleeps to go. There he is, looking out the window. He looks wide awake right now. I'm cozy in my bed with lots of Christmas thoughts to think. Just two more, two sleeps left when I wake up, but I can't sleep a wink. Hmm, let's see about that. Oh, he looks like he's sleeping okay. Gary the dog as well. December 23rd, it's two more sleeps till Christmas. Why can't this day be done? If I can get just one more sleep, then we'll be down to one. So he's pacing back and forth, just waiting for the day to be done. Just two more sleeps to get through, then Christmas day will break. Just one more sleep plus another sleep, but still I'm wide awake. Do you think he is? No, he's fast asleep again. But Gary's still awake, looking outside. Looks like the snow's coming inside. All right, December 24th, one. One more sleep till Christmas. Is this day finally here? I put out Santa's cookies and the, monk and the milk for the reindeer. Man, he loaded Santa's plate right up. Look at all those. Santa's going to be happy with them. I'm 
snuggled in PJs and the stockings have been hung. The tree has been unplugged and all the carols have been sung. So he's saying, I, I'm ready. Just one sleep left till Christmas. The day is coming soon. And can it be? I think I saw a sleigh go past the moon. So he's, been lit. he's looking through his telescope. Gary's asleep. He's wide awake. Let's see. Oh no, he fell fast asleep. But Gary is looking through the telescope and what does he see? Can you see the reindeer here in the sleigh? Today it's finally Christmas. I run down to the tree. I can't believe it. Santa came. These gifts are all for me. Taking the fast way down, it looks down, down the stairs, using the rail. Merry, Merry Christmas! It's really truly here. And now I start the countdown. So you do the happy dance. Only 364 more sleeps till the next year. And there he is, fast asleep, Gary too under the tree. So, kiddos, we have this book here. You're welcome to check this out. Uh, still curbside, but have your parents call us or whoever. And, or you can email me, email the library, or get on Prairie Cat, and we'll get you this book. And we have a few others if you're interested um, of our newer books here. I'm Not Just a Scribble, very cute book. I've read that one. The Big Umbrella, very, also have seen, <laughs> I've checked out probably all these behind me, so. <laughs> the Big Umbrella, because Tucky Joan and the Little Heart, The Day the Crayons Came Home, and Fire is Light. And let me move the tree so you can see that a little bit better. But any one of these um, are here for you to check out and enjoy. And you know what? With this winter break, you don't have to, like, uh, hit the books at school, but you can come and get the books at the library and enjoy some good reads and some hot cocoa and, uh, you know, stay in your PJs and if you like until you return to school. Just enjoy your winter break. And next week, though, come back for another Storytime Saturday. It'll be the last one of 2020. And we're reading Snowmen all year. And afterwards, we are going to make some play snow. But if you have some snow before then, uh, get out there and build a snowman. Get outside, and our first day of winter is coming up on December 21st. So, I don't know if we're getting snow, but if we do, yeah, enjoy it, guys. Um, and build a snowman. So, I will see you then. Have a happy holiday from the Polo Library.